All right, good evening and thank you for joining us. Your local Delta News at 10 begins tonight in Jackson where two sisters sentenced to life in prison are about to go free. They've been behind bars since 1994 for a robbery where only $11 was stolen. WXVT Steve Dreyer has more on that story tonight. Oh, Haley! Yes! Can't you see? Can't you see? It's time to set the sky free! free. After spending the last 16 years in prison, Governor Barber is suspending the Scott sisters' life sentences. Back in 1993, they were arrested for the robbery of $11, and the other men involved in the crime only spent a few years behind bars. State Senator Willie Simmons believes the Scott sisters are being released because they pose no threat to society. The criminal who is a threat to society. We do not feel that either of these sisters would be a threat to society. We know that the medical cost is tremendous. We know that the governor, the parole board, and all of us have looked at that case individually, and we feel that this is the right thing to do. Several hundred people gathered in Jackson on Thursday in support of the sisters' release. Greenville resident Jairibu Hill, who is with the Mississippi Worker Center for Human Rights, spoke at the rally. We kept the pressure on, and now we have to keep the pressure on to make sure that Jamie is re restored to as much health as she can be restored to. Yes. She did not have collapsed kidneys yes. when she went in on a wrongful conviction. Yes. And now we have to make sure that she's taken care of and that the family is restored to some sense of normalcy. Senator Simmons spoke with the women prior to their release and was encouraged about their inner strength and strong family values. They were not mad at the system. They just had to be patient with it. They didn't have this anger. Uh, that you would expect coming from them. So I was impressed uh, after spending an hour and a half, two hours with them, and just listening to them talk about their family. Steve Dreyer, WXVT, Delta News. Now the Scott sisters should be released from prison sometime next month. Along